So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and then type in Task Manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to make sure that Roblox or Roblox Player is not running. If you see Roblox or Roblox Player, you want to right click on it and then click on End Task. Then you want to head over to the Details tab and then do the same thing. If you see Roblox or Roblox Player running, you want to right click on it and then click on End Process Tree. Now for the second step, you want to head over to Search and then type in Check for Updates. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Check for Updates and do all the updates your computer may have. Now for the third step, you want to head over to Search again and then type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator and then click on yes. Now once you're on this, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and click on enter. Now for the next step, you want to make sure that your graphics card drivers are fully up to date. So for me, I'm using an NVIDIA graphics card and I downloaded the GeForce experience. If you're using AMD graphics card, you want to download the AMD Radeon software too. I've left links down below to download your software. Now once you're on your software, you want to click on the drivers tab and then click on check for updates. Make sure that your graphics card drivers are fully up to date. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search again and then type in Roblox Player. You want to right click on it and then click on Open File Location. You want to right click on Roblox Player again and then click on Open File Location again. And now you want to find the Roblox Player beta.exe application. You want to right click on it, click on Properties and then click on the Compatibility tab. And then you want to take Disable Full Screen Optimizations and run this program as Administrator and then click on OK. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and then type in view network connections. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to find your network adapter. You want to right click on it and then click on properties. And then you want to click on internet protocol version 4. And then you want to make sure that use the following DNS server address has been selected. You want to make the first line 8888 and you want to make the second line 8844 and then click on OK. Now once you complete all the steps in the video, you want to restore your computer and then the problem should be fixed. But if it's still not fixed, now for the next method, we're going to head over to search and then type in add room with programs. Click on it. Now once you're on this, we're going to scroll down until we find Roblox Player. You want to click on the three dots, click on uninstall and then uninstall it. Now you want to install it again and then that's fix the problem. 